Some people talk of a mid-age crisis around age 40, but tonight we've got a 40-year-old that just wants to rock and roll or play any kind of music. Steve's Music Store is a mecca for generations of musicians and wannabes in Montreal, and they still let you play before you buy. Amanda Pfeffer takes us on a tour. Over the last 40 years, if you play music in Montreal, then Steve's needs no introduction. This is actually the first bill book of the first things I've ever sold when I was in the store. I was Steve in the store Kerman rented the store on the old Craig Street radio, with $800 in his pocket. And there we go, the first guitar that I sold was $16 and I sold the gentleman an extra two strings for it and I sold him a beginner's book. And a star was born. The Beatles were very, very hot in those years and I made that my forte. And I ran every night to all clubs to talk to musicians to come down. It didn't take long for Steve's to become the biggest store in Montreal and some argue the whole country with outlets today in Toronto and Ottawa. Today the little store on Craig Street has expanded to take up almost an entire city block. It sells some 80,000 different products. We have Augustine, we have Dean Markley, we have DR, we have Dario, we have John Pierce. An assortment of uh, microphones for drums. And we have Elixir, and we have Savarez, and we have Gibson, and we have Fender. And guitars, well, they've got those too. And I've known it for so many years. But what makes the experience really special are the people. You can rub shoulders with superstars either on their way up. Everything started here, you know, like I started to play guitar and after that I started to sing, you know, like and everything came from the day I bought my guitar. We have Celine Dion, we have Bowser and Blue, we have Michelle Rivard and we have Jeanette Renault. And that's what makes it fun, that's what makes this industry so much fun. Because we're not just dealing with people who play music or musicians who play music for a living. We're dealing with doctors, lawyers, dentists, um, employed, unemployed. Oops, hang on a second. When I was 16 years old, I saved up my money and I bought my first guitar at Steve's Music Store. That was a long time ago and I still don't play very well, but it introduced me to the excitement of music and I'm certainly not alone. For generations of young people, Steve's is where they got their first musical instrument. And Steve sells to most school boards in town. But among the customers, there's a real range of talent and volume. After a while, it gets you. Steve Kerman is pretty modest about his contribution to music in this city. He doesn't even play a musical instrument. And he says he just wants to thank all the people who've come in over the last 40 years. Amanda Pfeffer, CBC News. Montreal.